What's up, Drew? Lance Gallery from the Detroit Pistons. Just want to say thank you for all your support. Give you a shout out. Detroit Drew. Check him out on YouTube. Peace. Yo, this is Rick Mahorn, the bad boy. Giving a shout out to my man, Drew. Detroit Drew. Make sure you tune in on his YouTube channel. Detroit Drew. Bad boy. peeps how's it going man we are finally to the point of the season where we are to the nba finals and of course it's between the la lakers and the miami heat and we got a lot of story behind this one it's gonna be a good series uh through and through but you know the thing that's gonna be talked about this entire series is lebron and pat riley didn't really leave on great terms lebron Going back to the finals for this 10th time is already remarkable. Going against his former team, the Miami Heat, Pat Riley has now reached the NBA Finals in six different decades. Very impressive. They are going to the NBA Finals for the first time since LeBron. So, who is going to win game one? Before we talk about that, let's talk about some key matchups. So, I think that you know, Jimmy Butler's going to have to guard LeBron. It's what he did in Chicago when they had to play him in Cleveland and when he was on the Miami Heat as well. So Jimmy Butler's accustomed to it. But again, Jimmy Butler is not enough to stop LeBron on his own. So they'll have to throw some double teams that way. Uh, Bam's going to have to guard AD. I don't know who Miami will be putting on, um, you know, McGee or Dwight Howard or any of those guys. Uh, why AD is out there because Bam has to guard AD. You know, AD is a problem, and AD can force a lot of mismatches. So they have to take care of those two guys, and, you know, I think that will be a good matchup right there. Uh, on the flip side, the Lakers have to stay committed to the shooters. Uh, very curious and very excited to see how well Hero can perform on the biggest spotlight in the NBA, and that is the NBA Finals. If he can keep shooting the lights out the way he has been, Miami's going to have a good shot because Miami plays as a team. Miami is not selfish. You know, it doesn't matter if Jimmy Butler gets 30 points. It doesn't matter if Bam or Robinson or Hero gets 30 points. They don't care. They just want to go out there and win. And they're motivated. They're a good defensive team, good offensive team. Don't just think because the Lakers are the favorites, they're going to walk around on them and just dominate. They have an opportunity to. Anytime you have two top five players in the league, you have the ability any given night to dominate a game. So... I'm very, very much looking forward to this one. It is going to be a battle. I don't think either team is going to be backing down, even if someone gets down 3-0. I don't think the other team will ever quit. Uh, I don't think these guys will quit until the clock is 0-0, and even then they'll still be going at it. So I expect Jimmy Butler to talk some trash to get his teammates um, up and confident and want to get some fight into them. But then we got, you know, two good coaches going at it, and uh, – uh, Vogel and Spotra, Sp Eric Spostra. Like, these guys know how to coach. They're good at it. So, you know, besides the LeBron and AD factor, not too much uh, advantage for either team. You know, um, I just think the lack of star power for Miami is it's their biggest knocking point. But anytime you got a player like Jimmy Butler, who's a borderline superstar, don't know if I want to call him a superstar, but he is an all-star, and he's got these teams, you know, these guys ready to play, I'm looking forward to it. I will be happy either way. I'm not playing favorites this series. Uh, I would like to see Jimmy Butler get his first ring. But at the same time, I'd like to see the Lakers win it for Kobe. So I'm pretty neutral in this one. I'm just going to sit back with my Drew Weisers and watch the games and just enjoy it. So let me know who you guys got winning tonight. Leave it down below. And then uh, let me know who you got winning the series. I do think Miami will take game one. I think they're hungrier. Um, you know, I just I think the rest of the Lakers besides LeBron might be a little bit um, content. LeBron doesn't want to settle for Western Conference championships. He wants to settle for NBA championships. So I know he's going to be locked in and focused. 
But uh, if he gets going, he can he can carry the Lakers, man. So it's going to be good. Um, I think it's going seven either way. And uh, I don't know who I want to win. So, sorry. But let me know what you guys' thoughts about this. Instagram, Twitter, DSA members, DSA website, DSA channel, all in the description. Check all that stuff out. And I'll see you guys here tomorrow. And that's the bottom line. Because Double D said so. Peace.